Welcome back to IndianTimesDaily.com and the top 10 headlines from Gujarat are Japan's Prime Minister Shinzo Abe has wrapped up his two-day visit to Gujarat after participating in the Indian-Japan Annual Summit. Prime Minister Narendra Modi said that his dream of seeing Mini Japan in Gujarat has come true. Prime Minister Narendra Modi will inaugurate the new marketing yard in Amreli on September 17. The yard built at the cost of 125 crore rupees has a cold storage with a capacity to store 500 tons and all facilities of food and stay for the farmers. Vadodara Congress leader Prashant Patel has declared unemployment allowances to the youth until they get employed. The Congress is on the run to assure employment for the youth whilst the election campaigns over the state for the assembly polls. Heavy rains have lashed several parts of Haruj causing severe water logging. Officials said that the amount of rainfall recorded was two inches within two hours and the weather took a sudden change amid humidity. The Commissioner of Rajkot has condemned the contractors for using low quality material for the repairing of potholes in the city. Legal action has been taken and appropriate corruption charges have been registered against those who pleaded guilty. Past convener Hardik Patel has organized a Sankalp Yatra with 182 cars from Ahmedabad to Somnath. Patel said that the pilgrimage has been organized to counter the BJP government. Alpesh Thakur of Kshatriya Thakur Sena will address a Mahasamelan in Patan on September 24th. Thakur said that he couldn't afford to miss the 2017 elections, adding that he would anyhow form a party and fight for the assembly polls. A Congress MLA has been attacked by his own party supporters during a mass communication function held in Bard village. The activists came in the middle of the function and created a ruckus, deepening the internal dispute of the party. Indian cricketer Ravindra Jadeja with his family has visited Ashapura to seek blessings of Mother God. Jadeja has been fond of visiting this temple and surely does so once a year. A trend has been set of playing a fusion of ancient and modern Garba while donning the traditional costume during the auspicious festival of Navratri. The youth of Gujarat has always come up with new innovations when it comes to Navratri every year. This is the end of the news bulletin. Stay tuned to IndianTimesDaily.com as the news from Bollywood is coming up next. And do visit the resources section on this portal to find the best inter-Canadian businesses and resources from accounting firms to wedding planners in your city. All of us at Indian Times Daily wish you have a great day.